we'll wrap mm -hmm. it around and we'll raise it. I'll go up there and sight it. And when you get, I have a ladder, a couple of ladders here. And we can, okay. um, once we get it sighted, we can attach it the same okay. way. Okay. okay. And then you put the tape on it and that's it. I'm Andy Schuster and uh, I'm doing sculptures here at Kasno at the Stone Quarry Art Park in Casnovia. Um, what we're doing is we're creating, we're taking and creating a graphic using the forest. Uh, we're putting up uh, white bands on the trees to create a section of the tree which uh, will be exposed to create a kind of a graphic stripe. As we continue to fill in the trees, the graphic will become more visible. Um, I kind of chose white because I figured that in this area, in the snow in the winter, it'll make that part, portion of the trees really vanish. Uh, and the, you'll have very strong graphic band across here of uh, uh, the tree trunks. Um, the, the way we're laying it out is such that visually, as we go back into space, they all line up in order to create a more flattened image even though physically they are at all different levels. The material is actually a, a kind of a white plastic they use to uh, cover ice skating rinks uh, and, and duct tape. And that's really about it. Uh, we just cut these strips out of uh, poly, poly tarp and um, attach them with uh, duct tape. What I'm going to do though later on, after we get this all in place and we have all the trees marked, uh, I'm going to go in with a level and I'm going to create a very severe kind of uh, level on the bottom of each one so to make them uh, the graphic stand out even further.